we hear about this word commitment thrown around all this time and I think commitment just comes down to just these two things and if you really understood these two things it would make all the difference in our life at the end of the day commitment just comes down to number one doing what you say you're going to do I think this is so important I think this is one thing that my father has instilled in me that your word needs to be law because how can you expect someone else to believe what you're going to say if you don't believe what you're going to say if you don't believe in what you actually say so that's the first part we talked about goals dreams and ambition and listing out what is the price to pay and deciding if you're willing to pay the price so if you say you're going to work out and train at the gym five times a week then do what you say you're going to do if you say that you are going to cut out Facebook and limit Facebook to 15 minutes a day, then do what you say you're going to do. That's the first part of commitment. The second part of commitment is taking action in spite of your thoughts, feelings, and emotion. Now, why is this so crucial? It's because there's going to be days where you don't feel like doing what you say you're going to do, and this is when you need to be reminded of it. So for example, this vision board over here, I've got my fitness goal as completing the Spartan race and training for it. And I listed one of the steps was to train at the gym five times a week at least, regardless of whether I'm traveling, whether I'm jet lagged or where I am in the world. Now, you know what's gonna happen? There are days when I take a 15, 20 hour flight to South Africa in Johannesburg and I reach at 5 a.m., I've got to speak at 10, and you know what? There's gonna be days where I just tell myself, you know what, I really, really deserve to sleep in today. And you know what's gonna happen? The alarm goes off early in the morning, and what do you think normally happens? The first thing that comes to mind is reasons and justifications of, you know what, I deserve to sleep in today. You know what, I deserve the rest, I am jet lagged. And that is when I want you to remind yourself. The definition of commitment, what is it? It is take action in spite of your thoughts, feelings, and emotions. And that is commitment.